Welcome back, everyone. We're back, and we're back doing draft again. Welcome to Cards Against John Sanity. We are here again today to do another premier Kaldheim draft. Our last draft managed to get us to seven and one on the last set, which was absolutely incredible. So we got full prizes for that. Unlocked some new bits, hopefully for the Orzov Angels build that we're going to be showing you at some point. But today we're going to crack on and we're going to use the gems from the last draft to see if we can get any further on this draft as well. Uh, shameless self-plug to begin with. Like, share, subscribe. Check out the links in the description for previous videos and for Duffer Model Shop as well, where you can get all your magic supplies from in the southeast area. Shameless self-plug over. Let's get started. So purchasing ourselves a draft we're gonna try and hopefully i'm gonna say this now draft something that's not blue white flies like we did last time and hopefully not deliberately try and base it around the rare let's see if that lasts oh it might actually last let's just change the layout uh, i feel like we should take the rare let's not base it around the rare no let's 100 base it around the rare Let's see if we can get some sort of blue draw deck going on. What have we got? Beginning your upkeep, may I exile Cosima. If you do it again, whenever a land enters the battlefield under your control, if it's exiled, you may put a Voyage Counter on it. If you don't, return it X plus one plus one and draw X cards. Ah, oh, it's a draw deck. Let's try and get some drawing stuff. Um, oh, should we try and build just absolute nonsense for this? Like, Pure nonsense. Whenever a vehicle you control deals combat damage to a player, that player exiles that many cards. Let's try and do something stupid. Like, really, really stupid. So, let's go. Let's go for Bloodline Predator and just secure it early. If we can name some creature types. Inga Runeyes. I've not seen this card before. When it enters the battlefield, scry three. If it dies, draw three cards if three or more creatures died this turn. So, that's a combat card. Oh, we've got Raiders Kev for vehicles. We could go low cost crew vehicles, potentially. Should get a 3 3 for 4 because it's Scry's 3. Yeah, let's do that. What is it? It's a human wizard. That's a god, so it's not going to count for a shapeshifter. Blue humans, is that a thing? It's not going to be a thing. This is already going to be awful. So let's quickly name the deck. Can we name the deck yet or not? No, apparently not. But we're going to sit around the table and wait for. I'm not even going to try because that was borderline offensive um, and pronounced that, but they're hanging on to three packs. I already hate that person. I apologize. Oh, dropping stuff all over the desk as well. It's very orange in here today. The block of flats opposite half the windows are open because it's a bit warmer and they're all directly shining sunlight back down here, which is why we've had the blinds slightly open on one side. Okay, looks like we're going two colors. Should we do, we're going to draw and they're going to discard. That could be fun. I love Elder Fang Disciple as a card. I think it's really, really cool. I've said this before and I'm taking it. You can help crew the Omen Keel as well. Let's try and get in some return to hand or return to battlefield stuff too. Oh, give stuff flying. That'd be great. Uh, Grim Draga. Plus one plus zero menace. That's pretty cool. Another Raiders Kev. Let's take the Rune of Flight. Let's take this cool, let's take the cool stuff first at this stage. Orange juice, strawberries, raspberries, blackberries. It's all right. Okay. No, that's giant based. Don't particularly want that. Do I want the snow island just in case for later on? I do want the snow island for later on in case we get some decent snow cards. Which could be fun. Could be really, really fun. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Having a bit of a cough there. All right. How far on the table are we? Oh, look at you. Sitting on your five packs. Get cozy, everyone. It's going to be a long old draft. While we're doing that, let's actually check out some of the other cards we've got. Let's re read Kasima again and see what we can do with it. Begin our keep my exile Kasima. Okay, fair. If you do it, gains whenever a land enters a battlefield under your control. If Kasima is exiled, you may put a voyage counter on it. If you don't, Return Kasima to the back. So we can keep that in exile and just stack on it, which would be really cool. 
Whenever a vehicle deals combat damage from a opponent that player exiles that many cards from top of the library, you may play those cards from among those cards. That's really good. So we just want some vehicles, I think. Low costing creatures and some and some vehicles. You're cool because you're a changeling and I like them. Or do I want the... I'm going to take the ice tunnel because it's in colour and it's a snow land. We might get something later on that benefits from snow. Like the other day when we did the draft and we pulled... Um, well, we could have potentially taken the icebreaker kraken. But we were we were on colour in blue, but we weren't anywhere near close to gaining anything. Let's go. Let's go for the harbinger. You could be helpful. Only to foretell a card from your hand or to cast an instant or sorcery. Well, we have none of them yet, but you're a one you're a one crew. So we can crew the omen kill with you. Which is nice. But I want to try and get some sort of return to hand or return to battlefield cards. What have we got in this set? We've got the one that returns one target creature or two creatures of the same type to your hand. Um must be some other bits as well. Mill three. I don't particularly want to mill anything from myself. Uh you are good in the long term. It's surprisingly a good card. It blocks, and then at the end of their turn, tap, and then they lose free life, which is really cool. Because if it blocks and kills, that's even better. And it's a knight, but it's never going to see standard play. I hope. I've said that about other cards, and it happened, and it was a, it was a shame. But there we go. These things do happen. Okay, background. I think to the start, uh, we've got two snowlands. Um. Let's take Priest of the Horn. It's not going to crew vehicles, though, is it? Arr! <laughs> That's going to mill them. Let's take this for now. We're sitting on two. Don't want to be that guy. Return target creature card from your graveyard to your hand. Let's take you, because you're a return. Or do we take a vehicle? It's a land card. You might put it onto battlefield tapped. Let's take you, in fact. Let's take some vehicles and see what we can do with it. My guess is not a lot. Because eventually I'm going to want some sort of removal as well. Because white, as we saw the other day when we did the other draft, Bound in Gold is a really good card. Still got no instance of sorceries. Uh, now we can take the Recruiter. Three, three for four with a four drop bikes. That's really expensive. That's a sh awful card. Nearly. Nearly YouTube sensors. Is your video for kids? Nope. Is it still that same person sitting on them? Yeah, they've definitely disconnected. Ugh, let's take the snow. Just go, I've got it. Into the sideboard you go. Into the sideboard you go. Into the sideboard you go. What are we pulling next? Ooh, blind step pathway. I don't have a card, but I don't necessarily need it for this. What I do need is removal. <sighs> there it is. And Raven form again. That's just such a good card. Hopefully it comes back around. I'm going to take Feed the Serpent. I feel like that's the right call. I already know this is not going to be as good as yesterday, but we're just going to have a mess. Let's see what we can do with it. Zombies is a thing we're running at the moment. Ooh. Yes. I will take you, sir. You are in colour as well. Which gives Feed the Serpent as a two-drop removal. That's funny. And this is now a four-drop if we have that in play. That's all really, really cool. Okay, what have we got now? Oh, another... <sighs> removal or Snowland. Let's go Removal. I think we just need we just need some bits that are going to help. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. Wither Crown's not a bad card in this. 
Lose less unless they sacrifice it. Beginning your end step, each point loses one, you gain one. Four on our curves looking low. Two on our curves really high, let's take the four. Because chances are we're going to be able to play it. What else have we got here? Right, Depart the Realm. Nice card. World Tree. Which, I'm not surprised that one's gone past Realms. Priest of the Haunted Edge again. She's only got two Snowlands. It's going to be a minus two, minus two, which is not great. Let's take Depart the Realm. And now we're getting more instants and sorceries for you. Oh, Ravenfawn's back around. Sorry, you are mine. Yep, you're coming with us. So there's two copies of Ravenfawn now because it's just so good. We proved on we proved the other day when we ran this or ran Ravenfawn. It's a really good card. I do like Dream Devourer. Definitely what you might call an overperformer at the moment. It's just doing really, really well. So again, this video is going to be in two parts. We're going to have the draft part and then we're going to have the play part as well so we can see how we get on and because we're going to spend ages waiting for... This guy, Fujisawa again. Well, not again, but instead of... Instead of the guy who definitely disconnected. You're going to be a good blocker as well. But you're a sacrifice and I don't like that. But you return stuff. Oh, it's just all so confusing. But if we give it flying... Oh, there's a lot of things we can do, to be fair. There are a lot of things we can do. Okay, where are we now? Um, It's a vehicle. Crew 6. I hate it. Disdainful stroke. That makes sense. Take the counter spell. The current theme is zombies or wizards by the looks of things. Let's take the land. Because now you improve a little bit, which is good. We can do minus three, minus three if we ever pull those. Is it zombies or wizards? Let's have a look. Zombie. Zombie and wizard. Demon. Cleric. Cleric. We've got some different things running through. Put it that way. Uh, arguably, strategic planning is a better card, but this is a nightmare in limited. Let's do it. This guy in limited in general. Because then I'm getting rid of most of their deck. Oh, it's, there's a lot of if, ifs, ands, or buts with this. A lot of, but we do what we can. Who else are we waiting on now? Oh, same two again. What a massive shock that is. Um, you, you're in colour. And you're also a zombie, which is helpful. Oh, imagine if a zombie king turns up with this. That'd be really cool. I'd like more snowlands, though, to be able to play him. Uh, let's take another priest. Cleric, 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 zombie, 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 zombie. Yeah, it's going okay. Uh, yep, card for Harbinger again. Kin Seekers. That's a really good card. Oh, we've isolated so you can't have it. Right, let's go on to the next one, please. And I don't think I've been past anything else. Oh, yeah, what a shame. I think even my shackles are treachery. What have we got in here? Ah, you're good, but I don't want you. You're really good, but maybe not. You're very good. Oh, choices, guys. <sighs> it's not going to be the Berserker, even though I want it for other things, but we're not going to be that guy today. Um, let's go for the Disciple. Oh, uh, yeah. Longbow might come back around. We don't know that. Currently, I'm going to drop Doggy Pursuit. What have we got here? Oh, look at that. Another Disciple. But let's take the Snow-Covered Swamp. Yeah. Let's take more Snowlands. So five of the cards currently are land, which is good. Okay, what have we got here? <laughs> Another one. <laughs> You're helpful. Let's take the Faceless Haven. Because now we're up to five Snowlands out of this draft, which is really good. Really good going. Why am I buzzing? Who's buzzing me? Oh, I don't care. Right. Uh, 
yes, I want demonic gifts because I want the return value off of it, please. That would be really cool. Who's hoarding? Hate the fact that people hoard. Really annoys me, but I'm glad the timer kicks off as it goes further and further around. How many creatures are we running? 14. That's not a bad amount so far. 14 creatures, 4 instances. 14 creatures, 4 instances, 3 sorceries, 2 artifacts, and enchantment. What's the enchantment? Oh, yeah, we're in a flight. And we're doubling up on quite a few cards as well. Bloodline Protector might go for this stage. Or will it? I'm having a lot of zombies and a lot of wizards. Eh. Either or. We'll see what happens. Got more packs coming around. What have we got in here? That's good. Um, another return to the field. Let's take Bind the Monster. Because it's surprisingly effective. What have we got here? No demonic gifts. Drawing discard. Uh, let's take the creature, I think. Mm, I'm not a fan of you. Let's take the let's take the hawk. Because we can always drop it out. With the crown berg strider. Inspect field with tap out for If snow is spent, it doesn't untap. Uh I guess. Yeah, sure, big thing. More stuff. Oh no. We did prove the other day the raven's pretty cool. Let's take the raven. Boats come back round. That's worked out nicely. Uh, take away f one, two, three, four, five. Take away five is 28, so we've got to drop four at the moment. I don't think that'd be too hard looking at what's in there. Uh, Mr. Yara, let's take you. It's been quite a control you day by the looks of things. We haven't really got a finisher. We've, we're relying very heavily on Kasima. This is going to go badly, I can imagine. We've not really got much synergy going on. You're currently in contention probably to be dropped. You potentially are, because we're quite a low curvy deck. Look at all the twos in there. It's a lot. To, it's a very full two drops, though, everyone. You're quite potentially going to get run. Uh, thank you. You might be dropped. I don't see much reason of keeping you around. To be fair, I'm doing a lot of oh creature types purely for Bloodline Pretender. I don't think that's necessarily what we should be doing. You come in as the third. It's really hard to know what to drop. Um more flying and replaces itself. Flying is really good in this. Uh, own of target non opponent puts on the top or bottom. Uh, Ruin of flight. Let's do it. Walk on blast because uh, nothing else. You can go away. Glacial floodplains to Snowland. And you. Okay. I think we're done. Right. Now we've got to really think about how we're going to build this. Drop the reinforcements. We're up to 48. I've got to drop eight cards from this. How many land has it got? 17. Ooh, God. Um, because of the two of these we have, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's minus six, minus six, and it gets sacked. That's pretty good. But I don't like the fact this comes in tapped. Minus five, minus five, potentially better. And more streamlined for us. So we drop one. I've only got three vehicles and you're one of them. And I don't know if I want you to be a vehicle half the time. You're a crew three for a four four. Okay. Hmm. I'm going to keep you because you're interesting. Artifact or creature. That is helpful. Eight. Disdainful stroke I'm going to drop because I want to deal with stuff that's on the board. I'm going to drop one rune of flight. I don't think we need to. Maybe drop a raven form, but even that, I want to hit myself for saying. Feed the serpent stays 100%. Demonic want gift stays because it's decent. You stay. 
Mr. Yara, I am thinking, goes. How many creatures have we got? 17. 3, 4, 3. Okay, 5, potentially 4 cards go because we're running. How many are now? Is it 16? 17 still? God. All right, let's drop an island. No? Yes? Drop a swamp, actually. I want my sleeves done first. Let's think about sleeves. Sleeves. And we're going to go with... Should we have some pretty... Let's go with these ones. They look nice. Uh, okay. Two drop creatures. Uh, two drop slot we need to look at trimming down. I think. Yeah, six, one. Or one, one. Six and a four, seven. So it's the threes and twos we're looking at dropping. Half time, you're going to be a one drop. I want to keep you. You're a three, three. Mm, I might get. I'm going to drop a car for Harbinger. Because you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven creatures in the two drop slot, and that's enough. Three more to drop, potentially two, because we're now running how many lands again? 16. So potentially two, potentially three, definitely two. It may be you, because you're not really doing a lot. Can I play with 42 on a 16 land deck? It's a real pain that I don't remember seeing any um, Behold the Multiverses. You're going to come in handy because you draw, you replace yourself, you draw, you get rid of their stuff. Oh, only activating the cast of sorcery. That's annoying, but well. You get rid of their stuff. It might be you. I think it's you. I think we keep it like this. Uh. Cool. Okay, so we're going to run blue-black. So we've got one one-drop card. We're going to run... How many cards are in the two-drop slot now? 11. 11 two-drops. We're going to look at being a bit controlly. You've got a lot of snow. One, two, three, four, five. Could have had six. Glacial Flood Plane, but I don't particularly want to run the white. Um, some good back endy creatures later on. This I'm still unsure of, but I think we'll keep it for now. Three copies of Braven Form. <laughs> Funny. Um... And then the rest of it is just awful. How far can we go on such an awful draft? I guess you have to tune in for part two to find out next time. So take care. Remember, like, share, subscribe in the comments. Come back for part two and I'll see you later. Bye.